Hello, hello, hello! Welcome to Care to Education, where kids and their teachers come to hang out together. We have a few laughs and learn about big ideas. It's true, and if you ask me, it's pretty cool too. And speaking of me, I'm Tucker, and I'd like to think of myself as a guide helping you maneuver through the fun that is character education. And as always, um, well, I'm, I'm actually not. Not this time. I'm not joined by my co-host, Martin. I don't know where he's at. Maybe he'll be here in a second. But since Martin isn't here, I say we go ahead and reveal what we've been talking about all month long. Oh, and if this is your first time here, we like to focus on one big idea every month. And whenever we reveal it, we tend to say it out loud, like really, really loud. So if you're here for the first time and you don't know what the big idea is, don't worry. Just scream when I count to three. Ready? One, two, Stop! three. Gosh, you scared me. What, what are you doing? What? What are you doing? I'm revealing the big idea. No. N no? No, not yet. Why? Because I have big plans, Tucker. Big plan? Big plans for character education? Yes! I See, I was doing some research. What kind of research? Okay. I was looking at social media. Uh, okay. When I came across an advertisement for this amazing thing, I think that we could use during the big idea reveal. Oh, okay. You say you saw this advertisement on social media? Tucker, I already know where where you're going with this, but no worries. We all know we can trust whatever we see on social media. That's not true at all. So I clicked on this advertisement and it took me to this amazing online shopping experience called Denial. Sounds like you might already be in denial, but continue. And on this site, they're selling these amazing streamer launchers. Streamer launchers? Streamer what? launchers. They launch streamers. Uh, okay, that makes sense, yeah. And I thought it would be cool for us to, to, to use these streamers all over the audience every time we reveal the big idea for the month. Well, that sounds pretty cool, actually, but when did you order these streamers? Just now. I, well, if you order them now, I doubt they'll I'm actually be in here for today. No, no, I, I added next minute shipping. Next minute shipping? Yeah, all, although it's, it's already been three minutes. Delivery for Martin! You're, you're two minutes late, buddy. I don't think three minutes is really that bad, though. I think that's pretty good. Oh. Look at, look at the size of this thing. <laughs> this is gonna be epic. That's actually a pretty big box. Yeah, just like you planned, right? Just, just like I planned. Just, just like... Oh. No. Wait, what is it? It's tiny. Um... Is it supposed to be bigger? I thought so. How much was that? Like, how much do you pay I for don't, that? I don't think money is an issue here, Tucker. Okay, I was... You know you know what? Why don't we just use your streamer launcher, this one, and reveal the big idea? What do you say? Okay. All right, here we go. On the count of three, I want everyone to yell the big idea. And if you don't know it, just scream. Ready? One, two, three. Trust! is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Okay, now we're just gonna have the teachers in the room, okay? Teachers, yell it out. Ready? One, two, three. Trust is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Hit it, Martin. That was, that was awful. Awesome. I can't plan anything. Nothing I plan goes right. And now, and now no one will trust me. <laughs> Mar Martin, that's not, Martin, that's not true. <laughs> sure it is. Everything I do breaks, I might as well just flush my money down the toilet. Flush, drain, toilet, drain, excuse me. I'm, I'm not sure what happened there, but I don't think Martin should feel bad. Looks like the person that was actually untrustworthy was whoever sold Martin the streamer launcher. And it was a bit of a false advertisement, if you ask me. Yes! I found it! Tucker, look. 
Okay, yeah, so looks like you need to go to the bathroom. No, see this, see this, see this? Yeah, uh, 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 oh! Streamers! Oh, yeah, the, okay, so how do we launch them? Don't ask questions. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Let me introduce myself. My name is Mark Hell, and I'm here to tell you about our big idea this month. And trust me, it's a good one. In fact, it's trust. Let me demonstrate it for you. Have you ever seen a trust fall? It's where one person stands with their back to another person or group of people and then slowly falls over backwards, trusting that the people or person will catch them. It can be a scary thing for just a couple of seconds as you wait for the other people's hands to reach you. Let's think more about the trust fall for just a minute. For it to work, the person falling has to have confidence that the person or people behind them will catch them before they hit the ground and the people behind them have to be trustworthy. Or in other words, they have to have shown the faller that they will do what they promised. So what if you were a trust fall catcher? Have you shown your friends and classmates that you can be trusted? Do people believe you? Do they know you will do what you've said you will do? And what if you are a trust faller? Do you have people around you that you can trust? Are your friends the kind of people who will make sure you're okay and keep you safe. This month, we're gonna spend some time figuring out what it means to trust people and what it means to be the kind of person other people trust. So each month, we have a tradition, and that is to lean in real close and say the big idea together. So here we go. Lean in, get ready, and say it with me. Trust is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Let's do it again. Repeat it with me one more time. Trust is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Great job. I trust I'll see all of you again soon. Yeah, you ready? All right, here we go. Okay. Oh, hey there. I'm MC Haggis, and this here is my beatboxing partner, Seamus Big Famous. Give him a sample, Seamus. <laughs> Amazing than Spider-Man and the folks. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This month we're learning about trust. Putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Now, Seamus, I trust your skills as a beatboxer, right? Hey, right? Hey, right? Hey. <laughs> and you in turn trust my skills as the world's greatest Scottish rapper, right? Hey, right? Hey, right? Hey. <laughs> the same way you trust my skills with mixing our music, right? 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 What? Hi. What did you do? No, you hesitated. I hesitated. Yeah, you did. You hesitated. It's because everyone wants us to use this new hotshot music mixer guy, isn't it? See, there you go again. You hesitated again. I, I, I think my mix of our music sounds great. Here, let's give my mix of our latest song a listen, shall we? What do you think is wrong with those dogs? They, they sound like they're in pain or fright, and what do you think's causing all that? Hey! What? Hey! But you think my mix is causing that ruckus? I, 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 no, 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 I think my mix is just fine. I really don't see why I need to trust this new guy. Ha, huh. well, talk about timing. I just got an email with Mr. Hotshot Music Mixer of our song. Now we'll see who we should trust to mix our music, huh? Kick it. Word. So that... That was really good. <laughs> I guess, uh... I guess I need to trust this new guy to mix our music. He <laughs> seems like someone we can depend on. <laughs> hey, right. I say we rap about it. Kick it! I wasn't the best at mixing our mess, so the songs I mixed were a bust. So to fix our mess, we went to the best, so we put our confidence in someone we could depend on, and that's trust word. <laughs> okay. That, the dogs are just messing with me. That was a solid rap. Hey? Hey, who let you out? Hey, 
Hey, hey. Yeah, who let you out? Hey, hey, hey. Who let the, who let those dogs out? Oh, I say we write that down. That's a good one. Dogs are out. The dogs are out. Who? There, someone opened the gate. Is that good? No, no, no. Who let the canines out? Hey! Yeah, who let those canines out? Hey, hey, hey. Who let those canines out? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, everyone. I'm super excited to be able to talk to you about our big idea for this month. But before we get to the teaching segment, let's go over the definition one more time. Repeat this after me. Trust. Putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. That's right. Now, I was hoping to do a little demonstration up here, but I'm gonna need some help. Um, ooh, are you doing the teaching segment right now? Well, I was trying to. What are you doing? Uh, you know, just busting the move, you know, get down. You know, I love my jams, you know? Okay, oh, you, yeah, you're doing the teaching segment. <gasps> Wait, can I help? Wait, pick me, pick me, pick me, pick me. Uh, okay, but it seems like you're a little hyper. No, I'm fine. I just, I just had a, you know, a cup of coffee and backstage and might have had a little Red Bull in it, you know? Yeah. Okay, well, whoever helps me does get a fun treat for helping me out. Oh, a treat? That's awesome! Pick me! Pick me! Well, like I said, you seem a little hyper, and whoever helps me has to stay very, very still. Can you do that? <laughs> can I do that? Sure I can. I'll just, you know, turn my music off and then, uh, you know, no problem. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Okay. Are you sure I can trust you? Of course you can. Okay. I can't tell you what's in the gift, but I can tell you that as soon as I'm done talking, you'll be able to open that gift and enjoy the treat that's inside. Mm -hmm. So just go ahead and you can pick a box. Right there, this one, for sure. So there's only one thing you have to remember, one very important thing, and that's you have to stay still. You have to keep your body in one spot while I talk. Don't move. Stay, and this word is very important. Consistent. Can you do that? Uh, why do you want me to be prideful? Oh, no, no, no. I'm not asking you. I said consistent, not conceited. Consistent just means that you stay the same over time. Can you do that? Oh, yeah, I got it, I got it, I sure can. Just consider me a Thank statue. You. Okay. okay, so I have my helper here, so let's talk about trust. When we're talking about putting your confidence in someone you can depend on, we might end up asking two questions. One, how do I know who I can trust? And two, how do people know they can trust me? The truth is, we all might have had our trust shaken. <laughs> Still. Oh. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> sorry, I must have like hit some button or something. Uh, but, you know, just, I just gotta dance. JD, do you remember how I said it was very important that you stay still? Yes. You were dancing just now. Right, sorry about that. I, I got it now, I got it now. Go ahead, go ahead. Okay, so where was I? Okay, I remember. We all want to put our confidence in someone and we all want to be someone who other people can depend on. But what happens when our trust is shaken is that... Um, JD! 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 What? Oh gosh, I, I'm sorry, I did it again. I just know I love to dance, but oh. I was shaking the gift. I'm I'm sorry. Is 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 it something fragile? No, not really. It's just a treat for helping me with the story. Oh, well, if it's not fragile, then what's the big deal if I just shake it? Well, I can't tell you. It'll ruin the surprise of what's inside. So, I just need you to trust me. Okay, but why? 
because we've been friends for a long time, because I'm trying to teach the kids here about our big idea, because I know what's in the box and you don't. There are lots of reasons to trust me, but part of that trust involves not shaking the box. Okay, I guess. I mean, I just don't get what the big deal is. I want you to enjoy the treat that's inside, but I don't know if you're gonna want it now. Oh, <laughs> of course I will. I was just dancing, it's not a big deal. So you're saying no matter what's inside, you're gonna enjoy it when we're done? Uh, yes, sure. Okay, let me get back to the story. So when we're talking about trust, we all want to be people who are trustworthy and we all want to have people we can trust. But what happens when our trust is shaken is... JV! 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 Oh! Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm sorry. My bad. You were, you were, you know, having talk about your trust being shaken and uh... Yeah, I'll tell you what. Why don't you go ahead and open that box? Oh, okay. <gasps> it's my favorite soda! Oh, it's my favorite soda. Yeah. Mm. You said you'd enjoy it no matter what, right? Go ahead. Open um, it. Yeah, see, about that. I think I'm good. Um, I guess it's not really a good soda now. Uh, mm -hmm. How about I just grab the other one? No, you know? no, no. Okay, okay. That's the one you chose, JD. Oh, you didn't know that all that dancing was going to cause such a mess, did you? You know who did? You, you, you did. So before we talk about your soda, let me ask you. Why did you want to switch to this box? Well, it stayed still the entire time, and I knew it would be safe to open. Mm -hmm. Exactly. There's a quote that I want to share with you, and that I think we'll understand how our soda has to do with the big idea of trust. So remember when I said at the beginning I needed you to stay consistent? An author named Roy Bennett said this, Consistency is the true foundation of trust. Either keep your promises or do not make them. So what Bennett is trying to say is that when we put our trust in people, it should be based upon those people being consistent, proving that they act the same over time. Mm, okay. We want to look for people who think about the consequences of their choices and make smart decisions. We want to look for people who are kind and treat others right. Mm. We want to look for people who always try their best and are honest when they make mistakes. People who maximize their potential. Right, so you're saying, just like I knew by watching what happened to, you know, my soda and knowing what's going on with the other box, like I, I pretty much can choose which one I would rather want to open. Yes, okay. and when we watch the people around us, if we're paying attention, we know the people we should trust and the people that maybe we can't trust or maybe we just need to watch a little closer. Yeah, because it can be a little dangerous if you just blindly trust in someone. It can, just like that soda can can cause a big mess. The truth is though, we all can act or do things we might not want to do. See, consistency doesn't mean we're perfect, it just means we're consistent or the same over time. For instance, if you waited an hour, two hours or so, would you feel better about opening that soda? Uh, sure. And even though it might have been shaken up before, I mean, it, it would, you know, stay still if I just, you know, waited and it would be good again. Right. And if we mess up or let someone down, the best thing to do is to own up to it and prove that we can be trustworthy. But just like the soda, that can take a little time. Awesome. Well, thanks for you know letting me be part of your segment and sorry that I, I didn't trust you. Hey, it's okay. Why don't you have the kids repeat the definition of trust after you? All right then. All right, sure. Kids, repeat after me. Trust, putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Nice. Oh. 
was this guy? Who's this? Was <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm Lawson, and today I've got a really amazing story. Mom, the battery light's flashing. There's enough. Go on. So, I've got the story for you. It's still flashing. Keep going. There's enough, I promise you. Go on. Are you sure? Okay, anyhow, I've got a really awesome story today from this girl named Lacey. Now, Lacey's great at a lot of things in school. When the teacher asks for their haiku poems, she's the first to volunteer. When your mind is blank, find an emoji. Press send to say what words can't. And the whole class applauds and tosses confetti. Lacey's on top of it in art and, and social studies and PE. But when it comes to math, Mr. Branson says stuff like, Take the first digit of the dividend, then divide it by the divisor, and write the answer in the top of the quotient. And Lacey hears, wah, 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 wah. And on the test, she gets a D, which Lacey is pretty sure is worse than anything, except for an E, for emergency. Mom tells Lacey that she's gonna be okay. She just needs a plan. So, for the next test, Lacey studies hard until, until numbers start to come out of her ears. And the night before the test, Lacey makes sure to get lots of sleep. And in the morning, mom serves her a super healthy breakfast because eggs are great for your brain. And, and so is broccoli and, and raw fish. And mom asks, you ready to go, sweetie? And Lacey says, yeah, I'm great. But all she can think of is all the ways she might be able to get out of school today. Like like tripping over the family dog and landing on a canister of laughing gas while getting a bad case of cowpox. And mom asks, are you okay? And Lacey confesses, I'm not sure I can do this. Mom reminds her, trust me, you've done what you can. And Lacey takes a deep breath and decides, division is tough, like broccoli for breakfast. But I face the test, cause she can trust that she'll be okay. So she heads out the door ready for the day. So kids, never forget to floss after broccoli for breakfast. But always do remember this, that trust is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Hey, light's still blinking. It sure is. We got all the way through. Just like I said. Thanks, Mom. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time when we try to see okay, how- Okay, and now we're out of battery. Cut. I was getting a little tired of gymnastics and I didn't want to go. When Mom said it would be fun and I was learning to do more than ever, well, I guess I didn't really believe her, but she was right about the fun. I made some good friends, and we were all trying to help each other get better. In fact, I started to look forward to getting into the gym with my coaches and my friends. But then, they started us on the high balance beam. You have to trust yourself, and you have to trust your coach a lot. Coach taught me how to do the splits on the beam, he helped me with a handstand and reminded me I could do flips on the low beam. And then he said I was ready to move up. I didn't have a problem with the other moves. But the flip dismount? I don't know. Something was different. Scary. Coach told me to remember all the events that we had already done. He said I progressed really quickly and that he believed in me. I just needed to trust him when he said I was ready. It wasn't easy, but... I did it! 
So hopefully today you guys learned a little more about how we could, how trust works and how we can live it out in our daily lives. Knowing who to trust and how you can be trustworthy is something that is super important to keeping us safe as well as helping us create and make healthy relationships. You know what? Sounds like a big idea. So one more time, everybody repeat after me, okay? Trust is putting your confidence in someone you can depend on. Thank you so much for joining and I will see all of y'all next month. Trust is the foundation of relationships. I can depend on I give you my confidence Trust holds friends together like glue You trust me and I trust you We both do our best to tell the truth When it's not the easy thing to do Honesty can build a burn bridges All it takes is one small sentence You don't speak unless the truth is in it If you're in, sing it with us T-I-U-S-T You can trust Together like who you trust me and I trust you We both do our best to tell the truth But it's not the easy thing to do Honesty can build or burn bridges All it takes is one small sentence You don't speak unless the truth is in it If you're in it, say it with us Pressure's on, you can depend on me When life doesn't make any sense I know you're here with me And even when the pressure's on You can depend on me C-R-U-S-T T-R-U-S-T You can trust in me T-R-U-S-T T-R-U-S-T I know you're trustworthy T-R-U-S-T